Good morning everyone, happy new year and welcome back to my channel. Starting a new job can be exciting and overwhelming. If you are following through my vlogs, you probably have seen that I've started a new job at the beginning of last year. Till today, it has been around roughly a year since I started in this new job and I felt like I've been settling pretty well in this new role. Therefore, I wanted to share the below 7 tips with you to help you with a smoother job transition. Without further ado, let's get started. The first point that I wanted to talk about is to chat with everybody if possible. Take the time to talk to your new colleagues, from peers to partners. Introduce yourself, let them to get to know a bit more about you and for you to get to know about them. You can ask questions like how they landed in the current role, what they studied at uni, what they enjoyed the most at this new job, etc. etc. This will help you learn about them as a person and learn about job as well. Building relationships with your co-workers at the early stage of your new job could be very beneficial for the future. Just think about the scenario in the future where you need to speak to them or ask them for a favor. It will help massively if you have talked to them previously. The second point that I wanted to talk about is to really understand your job and responsibilities. Make sure you have a clear understanding of your roles and responsibilities. It will help you to understand what is expected of you on a daily basis and to avoid any confusion or misunderstandings. You might have already come across those lines during the preparation of the interview or during the interview. However, it does not harm to revisit those lines again. Put some time in with a line manager or someone you're going to work directly with to understand their expectations. The more detailed, the merrier. If there are anything that you're unsure about, make sure to ask follow-up questions until you fully understand what you're expected to do. The third point that I want to talk about is to learn the culture. Every company has its own unique culture and way of doing things. Take some time to learn and observe the company's culture. This can include things like office dress code, communication style, and company value. Browse the company's website and do not miss those arranged trainings. I know they could be boring. Adapting to a company culture will help you fit in better and understand how certain things are processed in certain ways and how the things work. How the things work. The fourth point that I wanted to mention is to seek feedback. You might have seen this in any other videos where it is asking you to ask your line managers for feedback regularly. Depends on the nature of the job, you can put in half year or quarterly reviews with your line manager and help you understand what you have done well in the past and what you're expected to do in the future. It also shows that you're interested in improving and developing yourself and shows good willingness to learn. Some people might feel awkward when asking for direct feedback. It does not always have to be formal. In some cases, it can just be after you complete a task, you can ask the questions like, how do you think I'm doing? Or is this what you're expected? Next point is be patient and take care of yourself. Settling into a new job takes time and Rome is not built in one day. It is important to be patient with yourself and not expecting yourself to learn every new things immediately. Give yourself some time to adjust and don't be hard on yourself if you made mistakes. Make sure to take care of yourself during the transition, get enough sleep, eat well, talk to your friends, exercise, do things that will help you relax. This for me personally is to go out to a cute cafe, attend a gym class, or walk in the park and make this video for you guys. The last second point that I wanted to talk about is to ask questions. Asking questions shows your interest in learning and improve. While it is important to ask questions when you don't understand anything, it is also important that you ask the right questions. Make sure your questions are relevant and thoughtful. Try to avoid asking the same question multiple times and do some research so the answer is less easy to obtain than a simple Google search. Last but not the least, don't be afraid of making mistakes. No one, no one can learn new things without making mistakes. Everyone makes mistakes, especially when they're learning something new. Don't be too hard on yourself if you make a mistake. Just don't overthink and do not be afraid of asking for help if you need one. Use your mistakes as an opportunity to learn and improve. I hope you find these tips helpful. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up or let me know in the comment section below and share your experiences with me if you want to. See you next time.